Hi, it's Mike Goodman here from Blast Fitness Camps in Ormston. Just here with Paul and Terry after their last session on week four. It's uh, nice and warm. Uh, just going to find out how they've been finding it and uh, how they found their first month of Blast Camps. If you just want to explain how you found it this um, month. I found it very good. Um, I found the diet challenging at first, but once I got into it, it was good. I found the, the fitness side um, excellent. Uh, I didn't uh, set off to lose any weight, but I've lost nine pound, um, and I feel really f a lot fitter and healthier because of it. Good, cool. um, yes, very interesting. Uh, I thought the self, the actual discipline required to uh, complete the course was very good, and uh, whereas I wouldn't have normally had that discipline, the regular exercises set uh, really helped after the first session. Um, uh, after the first few sessions, we sort of had a lot of aches and pains, but uh, after session, after week four, there's no aches and pains, and I'm a lot quicker than I was at the start. Um, so basically, a lot healthier, and lost a few pounds in weight, and feeling more toned as a result. Okay, that's great. So, did you have any sort of apprehensions or kind of fears before starting it? But and uh, how you found to cope with that? Um, my apprehension was um, was I going to keep up because I hadn't done a lot of uh, any training for quite some time. But um, everyone works their own pace, and I've enjoyed just working to my pace. The other apprehension I had was um, getting up early in the morning, um, but actually it strengthened my will to do that, and I feel it's given me a lot of uh, benefit from that. Yeah. Yeah, I would, I would say too, getting up in the morning as early as that and, uh, and, and, and then carrying out exercise uh, was certainly a bit of an apprehension to start with, but uh, towards the end actually I quite look forward to the sessions and, uh, and also the diet, I would say that uh, I was a bit apprehensive about the diet to start with and did struggle and realised just how much I um, had a craving for coffee and uh, dairy food, so it's been interesting coming off those foods and, um, and uh, yeah, quite a challenge in that respect, but uh, beneficial. Okay, so the first, like you said, the first week or two weeks of the diet was quite tough. Did it kind of, once you got into it, become a bit easier or was it um, quite tough? Right? Yeah, it was first, first few days were tough <coughs> in terms of giving up the coffee, yeah. um, but by the second, end of the second week, all the cravings really had started to go. Good. But I'm looking forward to having one coffee a day, perhaps when the diet, <laughs> <laughs> when the four weeks is over. Okay. Only one. Nice organic coffee. Organic coffee yeah. Yeah. and rice milk. <laughs> <laughs> and Terry, how you um, The only thing I found tough really was um, I enjoyed just one glass of wine in an evening. Yeah. Um, initially, because my wife carried on, initially, um, I found the first week um, tough, but now I'm used to not having wine, and uh, Jane, my wife, still has a glass of wine, but I don't even think about it. And I think it's just a question of habits, yeah. getting out of a bad habit. And it's a good, good habit. habit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's great. Great, thank you. Thanks.